Hi, this is Tim Yoder with Fit Small Business. Today I'll be evaluating FreshBooks for Chapter 4 of the Fit Small Business Case Study. This chapter deals with banking and cash management. Um, so the uh, first thing the case study asks us to do is to uh, determine whether the software can connect to the bank account to automatically update transactions on a daily basis. And yes, this can. So uh, if we go to accounting and we try to do a bank reconciliation, it will ask us to, oh, that's the help menu there. Um, it'll ask us to do a, to connect the bank. So you hit connect bank, be able to choose your bank. You can do this for your banks and your credit cards and it will pull over your transactions for you. You can then match the transactions uh, to items that are to transactions you've already entered into the books um, for both credit cards and bank accounts. So that's good. Uh, the next thing it asks is, can you upload a file from the bank with all your transactions? So some people prefer, instead of allowing the program to have a constant connection with your bank account, they prefer to, to uh, upload their banking transactions every month uh, with their statement through something like a CSV or QBO file. Um, FreshBooks does not allow that. The only way you can bring in your import is through um, is through a bank connection, not by uploading individual files. So let's go to our scorecard here. Um, can the software connect to the bank account? Yes. Can it upload a file of transactions? No. Okay. Okay. The next thing uh, the case that he asks us to do is to reconcile the checking account. And so this is where we get into some troubles uh, with FreshBooks. Um, so if you go again, this is what we just did, if you go to accounting and you try to reconcile your bank account, it requires you to connect the bank before you have a bank, before you can do a bank reconciliation. Um, so I've done a little bit of research and that is the case that you cannot reconcile a bank account in FreshBooks without having an, without having the bank account connected to FreshBooks. So you can't enter the transactions automatically and then have any sort of bank reconciliation. Um, so that's a problem. And if you've watched the prior videos on accounts receivables and accounts payable, remember anytime we input a cash transaction, the transaction automatically goes to our, let me pull it up here, to our petty cash account. Let me pull up our chart of account. I'm sorry, our reports. Actually, let's see, can I pull up detail here? Yeah, so this is our petty cash account. So remember, anytime we entered a cash transaction, it automatically goes to petty cash. And then the idea is when you do the bank reconciliation, you can choose transactions posted to petty cash and they'll be moved over to your credit card. I'm sorry, to your bank, to your checking account. However, now we learn we can't do a bank reconciliation unless we directly connect up our checking account. So it's really not so much that if we don't connect our account, we just can't do bank recs. It's not really just that feature. If we don't connect our bank account, we really can't use FreshBooks as our bookkeeping software because everything gets posted to petty cash. We can't tell it this was a credit card charge, this went to this checking account, this came out of this checking account. Everything goes to petty cash and without doing a reconciliation, we can't reallocate the payments to the correct accounts. So unless you're willing to connect your bank account, FreshBooks really is not the right software for you. Now that being said, there's really very little reason not to connect your checking account. Um, you know, some people may not trust the security of it. Um, you know, I don't know. I'm not going to be the judge of that. As far as I know, it's very secure. Their website says it's just as secure as your bank's website. I have no reason not to believe them, so I'll leave that to you. But some people don't want to connect their bank account. Most software is still quite usable without it. Um, FreshBooks is not. Um, you can't you can't tell it where what account the, the cash came from without um, connecting the bank accounts. Okay, so that is a problem. Um, so we're not going to be able to, to reconcile the account because we don't have anything connected. Um, so I'm going to go through and I'm, I'll give it half credit for the things that I think it can do, but it's really a, it's really, it's a design I don't care for um, where you have to connect your bank account. So open your bank reconciliation. I'll give it half credit because you have to have a bank connected. 
So all of these things related. Um, view outstanding transactions. Uh, yeah. So credit cards do have the same reconciliation feature, so I'll give them a point for that. Um, but I think that's a that's a big shortcoming in my opinion not to be able to to use the software without connecting your account because essentially even if you can connect your account you're only using the software in hindsight right so to me bookkeeping software you want to be able to at the very least use it as a check register right so when you write a check you want to be able to enter it in QuickBooks so that you know that money is paid out so that you know you only have so much left in your checking account that's available with this program you can't you can't even track the amount of cash you have in your checking account because nothing can be recorded in that checking account until it transfers over from the bank, until it clears the bank. So you have no way to reduce your available cash by outstanding checks. Nothing can be recorded in a checking account until it comes through the bank feed. And I don't like that. Um, so I think you need to be able to enter checks beforehand. Um, so that you can reduce the balance and then you match them through the bank feed. I love bank feeds, don't get me wrong about that, but you need to be able to enter information by hand as well so that you don't have to wait for things to come through the bank feed. So you can have a live snapshot of what your cash situation is right now, not after it clears the bank. Okay, enough said about that. Um, okay, that is uh, Chapter 4 of the Fit Small Business Case Study for FreshBooks.